Hey guys, this is John Spear with First Day Electrical here. I'm going to be showing you guys how to properly make up a box. So let's just jump right into it. Um, the tools that I use are strippers, linesmen, and dykes. And number one, square tip. I use the number one to put my ground screw in. It also helps with the screw on the box and it also helps with the device. It's a pretty universal tool um, that I use on a day-to-day -day basis. So just starting in, I got half of it made up right now. So what I like to do is grab it, go to my forearm, break it right there in the middle, twist it, grab my dikes, Clip it, throw that to the side, clip it again, get all the little burlies off, grab a cherry, stick it on, put it on, get this, pull to the side. Clip those little guys off, toss it to the side, get your MC connector, this one's a snap to it, get that on, boom, done, grab the box, alright, now that we got them all in, Gonna untwist it. And I always personally like to start with the grounds because they take the longest. So if you see the ground screw right there, what I normally do to start everything off is I'll get everything to that corner. have to be six inches outside the box per code which clearly this guy's doing what we need to be doing clip them all off at the same height make them all up or cut them with your strippers approximately I like to do like fingernail length on my thumb but like a good three quarters of an inch is perfect so, we'll get all those guys, bundle them up together, grab your linesman, pre-twist them. Cut off any of the excess. Grab a wire net. Boom. Next, you're going to go with all your neutrals, kind of stick them in the same line, but just right next to the ground, create like a little 90 on each one, once again, 6 inches, this is, I usually like to do thumbs up sign. Cut it off. Another fingernail length. Grab them, bring them all to the same height. Pre twist. Make sure it's nice and tight, nothing falls out. Okay, then finally move on to your hots. Bring everything to the same corner. Boom. 
Six inches outside the box. Boom. Bring them all to the same height. Pre twist. Wire nut. All right. So now they got all three in their own little dedicated location. Kind of start bringing them down. So you kind of fold it in half. What is it? Fold it in half. What is it? Fold it in half. Put it in. So this way, you'll have the ease in the future if you need to work on something to just pull it out and work on it. Another trick would be to put your cover plate on, but on the back of it, put the panel number and the associated circuit to it. And there's multiple circuits, put the multiple circuits with the associated color. And then you put it on backwards so when the painters come by, spray paint it, or do whatever they do, they're not covering the inside of the thing. You know exactly what it is when you open up the box. It makes it easier for the service guy or whoever is next in line. You should always be thinking about the next guy in line. Um, thank you. I appreciate you guys watching this video. Give me a thumbs up or a comment below. I would definitely appreciate it. Any commentary um, so I can keep making videos like this to help you guys along the way. Um, thank you guys so much and hope you have a great day.